Question 1. What are the benefits of a teamwork than working individually on a project? Answer. Well, teamwork is always a better approach and there is nothing wrong to say that when multiple minds work on a similar project, the outcomes are always superior. The prime factor is one can notice the mistake of others and can always give better suggestions on improving the final outcomes. Also, joint efforts always make sure of less errors and quick results irrespective of the project. A good team can always make sure of time management and delivery of project without deadline violation. Question 2. What should be the features of good collaboration software according to you? Answer. Collaboration software is becoming extremely popular in the present scenario. They come with a lot of features. Good collaboration software should be reliable, user-friendly, as well as easy to use. In addition to this, it must be secure enough to be trusted by the organization. Moreover, it must have compatibility with the currently available technology or applications that are a must in any form of business. Question 3. What sort of conflicts can be avoided by using Confluence? Answer. Confluence is a popular application for teamwork. Although teamwork assure excellent outcome in every aspect, it is also true that there are a lot of conflicts and issues that can declare their presence. Confluence is capable to simply eliminate all such issues irrespective of their nature and source. Moreover, there are problems such as human errors, glitches related to applications and so on that can also be eliminated with this tool. Question 4. What are the tasks that a collaboration software can perform easily and how they are beneficial? Answer. The team collaboration software can perform a diverse array of tasks that are required to maintain business processes reliably. In addition to this, it can always make sure of productivity without compromising with anything. It can simply connect two different users irrespective of their location for sharing ideas, information, management managing business processes and so on. Many time a project has different modules which are developed at different locations. A collaboration software is extremely helpful at such a stage as it can handle a lot of tasks easily that are required for the same purpose. Question 5. In what way confluence is time, as well as cost-saving approach according to you? Answer. Confluence simply eliminates the needs of making users visit or meet each other frequently when they are working on a similar project but are engaged in different departments or their location is geographically different. As ideas, discussions and other tasks can be managed simply through Confluence, it saves a lot of time and cost to up to a good extent. There are certain features that are regarded as best in every aspect. Question 6. Tell any three benefits of Confluence tool. Answer. It saves time and efforts cut down the chances of all major errors avoids conflicts among the resources powerful enough to be trusted or shows timely delivery of project. Question 7. How you will define a project that is generally accomplished within an organization? Answer. Any project is basically nothing but an array of tasks or activities that might need to be performed in a series for creating a product or a service. It is a basically not a regular activity but have a specific time limit for accomplishment as compared to other tasks in a business such as productivity. However, a business may engage in different projects and under those aspects it can be a permanent task. Question 8. What exactly project management according to you is? Answer. Every project has a team or resources working on it. Managing a project basically means utilizing the right skills and knowledge at the right time using the right technology that can be in the form of different applications. The aim is to assure the final outcome should be completed properly. Question 9. Can you tell some important factors that need to be cared of when it comes to a team collaboration? How they matter? Answer. 
Some of these factors are budget of the project, quality of the final outcome, scope of the project after accomplishment, the overall risks associated, utilizing of resources, all the factors matters because they significantly contribute in the success of any organization and assuring the error-free results. Question 10. Can activities related to a project can be different while working on a project in team collaboration? Answer. Yes, there are certain activities activities that can be different. For example, planning which often requires a lot of knowledge and skills up to a great extent. It is not always necessary that all the activities need symmetrical efforts and knowledge. Some activities are easily identifiable while some not. Also, when it comes to the execution of activities, they may vary in terms of required efforts. Question 11. What is the basic aim of Confluence tool? Answer. Well, the basic aim of this tool is to simply enable the remote users to jointly work on a project without facing any issue in processing, sharing, as well as management of raw data for a project. Question 12. Name any factors that matters a lot while working in a team. Answer. There are some important factors that highly matters and the top two are management capabilities of the collaboration tool of software processing of coordinated tasks. Question 13. In the Confluence approach, how you will make sure that every user has the latest version of an ongoing project? Answer. With Confluence, it is possible to simply create a workspace by the users. Data can simply be added in the same and everything is viewable, as well as accessible by all the users or team members working on that project. Their physical location really doesn't matter and in case any modifications are there to any of the file or data in that workstation, the same is acknowledged to all the users. Thus they always have the latest version of ongoing project with them. Question 14. Whom you call a stakeholder? Answer. Anyone whose interest is largely affected due to the project an organization is working on can be considered thus a stakeholder. While planning, as well as executing a project, the influence of stakeholders is one of the very significant factors that must be paid special attention on. Question 15. According to you, how the project's portfolio and programs are different from one another? Answer. Projects are generally undertaken due to an array of purposes that need to be fulfilled. On the other side, a program is nothing but an array of projects that is generally managed in a defined manner to accomplish the subtasks of an overall achievement. When it comes to portfolio, it is a series of programs, as well as projects with aim to help an organization in accomplishing a goal with high results.